Hello fellow handy members, 60 Vet here. Um, putting a little video together to show what my next project is going to be. I was asked by our church to uh, build a cabinet for our choir books and handouts and stuff like that. Uh, right now we're just using a cart that just seems to always get in the way and they wanted something nice on the wall. Uh, so I'm going to do this out of Baltic Birch and uh, I figured I would draw the thing up in SketchUp and again I'm putting a video together just to show you what SketchUp can do as well as what it is that I'm working on. Um, so if we look at the unit, this is what the unit's going to look like. It's going to be roughly 7 foot 8 inches across, um, four, almost 5 foot tall. Uh, it's actually going to be two individual units. You can see the separation here. So each unit's going to be 3 foot 10 inches uh, by 4 foot 11 and 3 quarter, or almost 5 foot. Uh, the reason I, I had a short and this is I'm using five by five sheets of uh, the Baltic birch and to make things work out to use the least amount of material I had to cut some sizes down so anyway so this is what the unit's gonna look like um, the back of it will be finished uh, with a quarter inch it'll be three quarter inch on the carcass um, and the shelves and quarter inch on the back um, I'm going to use a French cleat which is up in here you can see the French cleat and I think I'm going to make some legs for it to, to support the weight uh, so it won't be hanging just on the French cleat. So there, there, there will be legs on that as well. When the unit opens, it'll look something like this. The doors will open up. Uh, this front panel will flop down. Uh, so it'll be roughly a little over two foot with just these doors open and a little over three foot with the big doors open. And when you look at it from the front, it'll kind of look like this. Um, these guys here are, are for handouts for like new music and stuff like that. These actually will come out. They'll slide out. Uh, he can take them into the church and put them on a pew or just, uh, you know, leave them sit on this shelf like this or just leave it inside the cubicle or cubby hole, whatever you want to call it. Um, these shelves here will all be adjustable. And this shelf down here is a fixed shelf. Uh, that's the only one that's fixed, but these will be adjustable. So these actually, you know, if, if the cubicle was the right size, he could move them up in there if he wanted to. But then this would be a fixed height shelf. So one of the things that SketchUp can't do is do uh, a nice explosion. So if I had this done, it would be really nice to just go up here, click a button, and have every individual piece separated out and all the dimensions in place. So uh, SketchUp cannot do that. So I do it manually. So if we look at... Uh, the top and bottom explosion. This is what the, the top and bottom will look like uh, you know, with my rabbits on the end, my dado in the middle. Um, the outsides will look like this with my sizes in a, in a 3 8 deep, 3 quarter inch dado to hold that fixed shelf. Uh, the center one I call a center support um, will look like that except it, it'll have you know, a quarter inch on each side you know, and that part is this support here is is for this center piece in here, so that those those fixed shelves will fit inside there. And then you know the, the, this is easy stuff. The door I just had it for dimension purposes. The shelf, um, the floating shelves, the fixed shelf, the sizes, and then the drop door, uh, the size on that. So. Anyway, that's going to be my next project, and uh, like I said, I thought I'd put this together just to show what it is I'm going to be working on and to show a little bit about what SketchUp can do. So I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, we'll talk to you later.